<clears throat> hey guys, welcome back. Probably Skate here. Today I'm going to talk about uh, three tips or just three subjects of skateboarding. Uh, first one, progression. Second one, setting your goals, accomplishing those goals. And third one, uh, finding motivation. Okay, so progression. Now, <clears throat> the key to progression, I think, is positivity because you're going to be very productive. Now, with that said, there's negativity. And with that, uh, you're going to be uh, having a bad attitude towards whatever goal you're trying to accomplish is going to make you very unproductive in ways such as you're going to be in a hurry, uh, you know, you're not concentrated on what you're trying to do. And I think everybody can agree with this. When you're negative doing anything, you're going to be uh, uh, throwing a fit in a sense uh, such as like blaming everything but yourself like such as your skateboard or the weather now a lot of people at that point would give up and instead of doing that what you could do or what I do what I try to work on is <clears throat> I either can take a step back for a minute take a breather or I can start doing tricks that I already know and that way I can try to build up like a positive attitude again. Now what that does by taking a step back is it gives you the opportunity to take a different approach on to whatever goal you're trying to accomplish. So you can come at it at a different angle by taking that step back and maybe have a more positive attitude. Uh, who knows? Uh, that can uh, be applied to anything in life, any goal that you're trying to accomplish, not only skateboarding. So. Uh, just try that out. It doesn't hurt to try. Uh, let me know if it works for you. So, now what I want to emphasize to end this off is positivity will be productive and negative negativity will be unproductive. So the second thing I wanted to talk about is skating with friends and uh, setting your goals. This is part of progression again. Now, Skating with friends super useful because you always have uh, your friend support and you have this friendly competition to drive yourself to accomplish whatever you're trying to do. Uh, it's just, it's so useful. Like try skating with your friends. Like anybody will tell you that skating with friends versus skating by yourself is just so much more productive. Um, I like learn way quicker like try to skate with friends like that is super useful and if you don't have friends then it's okay you know you can do it by yourself like me I skate by myself and I'm, I'm still learning now accomplishing your goals I've tried things such as putting a lined piece of paper on the wall writing down my goals but it just becomes another thing on my wall I forget about it walk right past it uh, the only thing that's worked for me so far is having like a little uh, notebook, a memo book, anything. It can be a piece of paper, who, who cares? Something that you can carry around with you to hold yourself accountable. Now with this, I just wrote down like all my goals and anything that I wanted to accomplish. It, can, it doesn't have to be skateboarding, it can be anything else. And what you do with that is carry it around with you because it'll totally just hold you accountable like you know a lot of people don't have a, somebody there to light a fire under their ass and make sure that they're getting done what they need to so with carrying something like this around it really just made me feel like it's always bugging me because rather than being in the shower uh, and thinking about what I want to accomplish I could do it all the time thinking about it all the time wanting to accomplish it all the time so that, that really helped me out and just try it, it doesn't hurt. So just remember, skating with friends, having a notebook, uh, keeping your goals right in front of you. Keep them around you, keep them in your head and push yourself to accomplish it. Now the last thing I wanted to talk about is motivation. This is, I could talk about this forever. Uh, finding motivation is really hard and I think, I don't really have a tip for this, it's just more like if you don't have motivation, like really try to find it. It can be different for anybody. Like for me, personally, uh, my motivation is to just, I love skateboarding. I just want to progress in it. I have fun doing it. And always like on my Instagram, I see like all these tricks that I want to be able to do one day. It just seems, I see a lot of older people that inspire me because they may not have all the money in the world and they may not be, you know, they may be going from apartment to apartment, but 
they're living the life like they're they're happy they're like genuinely happy like i'd rather do something i love and be the poorest person on the planet than be the uh, richest person on the planet and hate my life and hate myself and not be happy doing what i'm doing so with that said just you know find your motivation uh find what drives you i want to do that even if it i mean i don't recommend anything negative but hey if that's what keeps you going do it uh, but find something positive first, of course. But if that's the only thing you've got, then go for it. Anyways, um, find your motivation. It's different for everybody. And I feel like that's just a really important, uh, long topic to talk about. So don't forget about that. Okay, guys. So remember, first thing, positive is productive. Negative is unproductive skate with friends um, and set goals right tear that piece of paper out carry around that notebook everywhere with you uh, don't forget it hold yourself accountable and then third thing or yeah third tip is find your motivation uh, do what it takes to find your motivation think about it figure it out uh, too complicated to for everybody so just uh, remember those things I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, like, subscribe, leave a comment below, and remember, you don't fail till you stop trying. So, till next time, guys. Peace. Definitely check out Skateboarding Made Simple. It's available on all these platforms, iBooks, railskateboarding.com, and Google Play. It's the most comprehensive video we've ever made and it teaches skateboarding better than anything else out there. You won't be disappointed.